Hi everyone and welcome to yet another episode of Nodegraph Navigator. My name is Ellen and I'm a part of the tech team here at Nodegraph. And today I will show you our uh, different types of layer that you can apply in the dependency explorer, showing you different types of uh, dependency. So starting off uh, seeing my quite simple demo environment here with no lines at all is because I have no layer applied. And we have the data dependencies, which is basically about data lineage, showing you how your data has traveled from data source to extract layer, transform and load. And you can actually see the full power of this through uh, expanding here, doing a little hiram related nodes. And you can see that this product in the load category comes from extract product and from our database. Um, here to the left. Uh, quite simple, a little bit more complex when we look at the process dependencies. And process dependency shows you uh, which uh, QBW that has created certain QBDs. So you can see here on my product that QBD that I have um, application extract QBW during uh, the high downloading nodes. I will see that. We have lines from extract.qw into products.qd because they are connected in that way. Uh, last but not least, we have the layer of data usage. And data usage is uh, data usage. Actually, we have lines because uh, we can see what data that has been used in this case. It could be either direct data or indirect data if you apply a where statement, uh, etc. So um, that was our three types of data dependency layers, uh, also called process dependency and data usage dependency. If you have any questions, you can contact us and we have more tutorials in this Node Graph Navigator series for you to check out. Happy Node Graphing!